Geralt. Are you all right? I'm fine. You? How'd you get in here? I squeezed through those bars. Look, it's bronze. What's left of him, you mean? What kind of beast would do that? Does that mean anything? Well, means our monster doesn't attack them. Seems they get along with whatever's prowling the sewers. Some kind of symbiosis. Hmm, interesting. What? Franz had a leg wound, right? Mm-hmm. Just above the knee. Managed to apply anything to it? Yes. Some spirit, but that was it. Why do you ask? Look, half of Franz's leg is gone. Monster must have chewed it off. Other bodies were untouched, except for the wounds they sustained in battle. Hmm. Are you suggesting the beast likes alcohol? Mm hmm. Mixed with blood. Doubt we'll learn anything else here. We need to find the lair. Right behind you. Well, it's not the most bizarre thing anyone's ever suggested. I mean, I think one of the um, <clears throat> one of the quests, side quests. Witcher contracts, I should say, it was the hunt of vampire who liked to feed on drunk people. Now, if I could fucking examine this thing. Another unfortunate there we go. romantic came to lift a prince's curse, found a hideous death instead. There we go. Mm, odd smell. Blend of alcohol, blood, and monster stench. Must have come through here. Oh, hang on, there's something over here in the corner to examine. Oh, hello. Woman's corpse, soaked in slime. Beast must have left it for later. Yes, but more importantly, oh, I thought it was a treasure chest. All right, never mind. Don't care. Fucking drowners, is loads of them bastards. There you go. See, that's what happens when you uh, don't dodge. There we are. Shiny, you look fucking pathetic when you're cowering. Oh, my cat's back. Oh. Geralt, pull your sword out. What's wrong with you? Wait, I just took out the wrong sword. There we go. Shiny, you're distracting me. And Tammy, you're distracting me. There we are. Wonder if you can hear the purring. I'd be amazed if you can't. I've got headphones on, and I can hear you the fucking mower. Is that right? Fucking cats. Love cats. Favorite animal. Also, lots of proud creatures. They prefer to hunt alone. And of course, you know, cats do so love to play as snakes. Which they do, if you ever look at them. At least it seems like they do. They've got the same looking mouths, actually. Oh, I saw something I think I could examine. No? Uh, well, here's some... Well, first, the way she was leaning and where I was standing, I thought she was missing a head. Another unfortunate romantic came to lift Oh, he's just gonna curse. say the same thing for most of them. Right, fair enough. Ooh, treasure. Negotiator. This is what I call aggressive negotiations. Let's not talk about Star Wars 2, though. Um, shift. There we go. Pretty hyped for the new Star Wars, though. Saw the trailer and, uh... Everywhere. Strange. Seems the monster tolerated them. As long as they don't get too close, I guess. Decaying corpses, slime everywhere, and that stench. This has to be the lair. Fresh and moist. Beast was just here. I'll collect my sample. Huh. All the tunnels and corridors converge here. What now? Need to lure the beast. How? We don't even know what kind of monster it is. But we do know it likes a blend of blood and liquor. Just so happens I've got some alcohol on me. Well, I hope you don't plan to cut yourself or... Relax. Plenty of bodies. I'll use one of them. Sample you collected enough? Hope so. But I'd still like to get some pure venom. Once you've killed the monster. To distill an antidote? No use for it once the beast's dead. Not true. I have a few poison patients on hand. 
Besides, I can study the venom, test it, maybe discover some interesting properties. That's surprisingly close-minded of Geralt there. He's like, yeah, whatever, once it be dead, you don't need it. Well, no, 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 it still pays, and you never know, there might... Another one of these monsters might show up in the future. I mean, you never know. It's science, bitch. It's important to know these things. I'll get to work. Hmm. I doubt I'd be much help in the fight, but you might need me afterwards. I'll look for a hiding place. You'd be better off waiting for me up top, or back home. But... No buts. Wait in the passage for now if you have to, though I'd rather you didn't. But when the monster shows, you run for the surface. Ugh, fine. Shani, look at me. Promise you'll stay out of it. I promise. Good. Now go hide. Be careful, Geralt. This is some Dark Souls shit. The fuck, wrong potion? Why? There we go. Toad Prince. I like it. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, God. Okay, well, first of all... Okay, the tongue is going to be a serious problem. The whole monster is going to be a serious problem. Oh, that's the damage I do to him? Oh, that is not good. Steady on that. Yeah, if he's just going to keep on doing that, that is going to get really frustrating. Maybe it'll be probably near to Ah, you fucker. Fuck, fuck, move. There we go. Dodge. Okay, that. That seems to be the way to go. We interrupted him. Ah, fuck's sake. Oh, lovely. No, he's, he's like a fat. The way he does that jump up is like a faster version of the fucking Asylum Demon. Oh, really? Yeah, I can see where my friend was coming from with this fight. Fuck this fight. Oh, it must have set him on fire. So this is why I have so much health and uh, armor. Well, at least we're getting a decent chunk of his health off. 
Ah, you piece of shit. Just, I wouldn't mind so much. If it wasn't for the knockdown. The knockdown is so annoying. I hate that shit in games. Oh, set him on fire again. I wonder if that's because I attacked his tongue. Actually, what I'm gonna do is... Hit me. The one time I want my monster to hit me. Okay, seriously? You have, like, the aim of a fucking blind person. There we are. Better than nothing, I guess. Now pop an actual Quinn. Yeah, it does seem like he gets set on fire more often if you hit him right in the mouth. Timing that is frustrating. Really? Oh god, it's so annoying. I'm, if, when, if ever I replay this, I am not looking forward to fighting this piece of shit. Ooh, nice dodge from me there. Nothing like a bit of self praise. Okay. Pop a potion. I'm actually going to do Thunderbolt. Gosh, really? Back to Eirden, because this is just bullshit without it. Oh, come on, I dodged. Fuck you, fuck you, game. There's not even so much to say about this, it's just so obviously frustrating. Just every time you start attacking, knock down. Start attacking, knock down. Just, oh! Knockdown effects are like the worst thing in fucking gaming, I swear. Ser seriously? I can add that to my new list of things I hate in gaming, you know, quick time events for generating health. Fucking knockdown effects, no jump buttons. I suppose you could summarize no jump buttons as just contextual platforming. Let's see. I wonder if there's anything else I can just chuck it in for a bit of extra damage. Oh god damn it. I was adjusting for the fact that he was jumping. What the fuck, Geralt? You stupid cunt. Shy damage, as I had anticipated. But, you know, better than nothing, right? Really, guy? Getting on me tits. The poison's not really coming into the fight as much as I thought it would. I'll woo. What's going on? Ah, he's finally come to. And he can speak human, turns out. Started thinking I'm not conversed in common the whole way. Except maybe with me reflection in the piss bucket. Where... Where am I? On the Albatross. On the fuck bath oil. It's that strange tongue, has it? En route to a fear. Don't remember signing on as a sailor. <laughs> oh, you didn't, mate. They dragged you aboard. Seems you killed their prince. Toad in the sewers. Damn it. 
Should consider myself lucky, I guess. Could have killed me on the spot. Depends how you look at it. Happen to know a bit of a theory. Heard them saying they come here on a mission, dispatched by their king to find their prince, lift his curse. Waited their honor, and that of their families five generations back, that they'd bring him home safe and sound. And I killed him. Great. So, must think they can save their honor by bringing the prince's murderer back to face the king's justice. And who might you be? Felipe Caligra, at your service. Petty thief, professional fence, and your guide about Oxenfield. One of a bit of time. Mm -hmm. And why are you here? You kill a prince too? Well, to their thinking, I had a hand in this one's death. See, I was their guide. Led them down into the sewers. But not until after you'd cut their prince's gut open. Sorry about that. Not your fault, mate. When all said and done, could have sat on my ass in the alchemy playing Gwen. Didn't have to brag about knowing Oxenford better than my own breeches. We been at sea long? Uh, Dunno, rightly. Not that long. Though, on the other hand... <laughs> but what's it matter, any road? Matters a lot. If they're hauling me off to hang me, I'm not in a hurry to arrive. Hey, I'm glad to be silent to a fear. I hear they got wild horses there. White, with black stripes. Always wanted to see one of them. Sure they're not. Black horses with white stripes? Nay, hey, black horses with white stripes they got in Zangwebar. That I'm sure of. Listen, there was a young woman, a medic, red hair. They capture her too? Don't recall seeing anyone of the sort. You were alone. Good. Means she managed to flee. Hopefully made it home. Tried to break out yet? <sighs> Used every ounce of charm I got. Nothing doing. Might be Maya Fury's, Rusty. Maya Fury's non-existent. Well, we'll be at sea at least a month. I'll teach you some of that time. Elkal! Orial! What's that mean? Told us to shut up. There's been a misunderstanding. Can I talk to you, Captain? Alakal Sorkan! Galavat Kar U Albata again! Quiet, dog. You killed our prince, and he'll pay for that. Gileam Balar, Carvarefaner. You'd be dead already. Rev Hagar, ne Aram et Ahmed. Then this is not ours to win, Anna. Dorgate ya Alami. We swore on our honor. How do I say? Take me to your captain. Falth alaghe ur egulath. What? Elkal. Falth. Vaelth, Halege Ur Igileth, Elkal, Inkal Aver Ikel Ugarevn Ulvita, Inch Aver Goliath. What just happened? What did he say? He said to sit quiet, and that you'll hang in two weeks. Then he added something like, We'll see who's in the mood for jokes then. Why? What did I say? Along the lines of, I want your nose bouncy, bouncy. Utter nonsense. Great. Give it a rest. No point talking to that lot. All you get's angry gurgles. And they puff up, you notice? While them fish. What's it they're called? There anyone here who speaks common? Ah, there's this mercenary with him. Looks a Danian to me. He's the one recruited me to show him through the sewers. Oh, and the mage, what leads them, knows a bit. Heard him talking, but I doubt either will talk to you. Uh, I was you. Catch some short eye. Not go on flapping my tongue. Got a long voyage ahead. Sleep's not what I need. Someone I can actually communicate with. That's what I want. Greetings, Geralt. Remember me? Orchard, your Gaunter Odin, known also as Master Mirror. I helped you find your Yennefer. We meet again, and it seems you need my help again. Heard a noose awaits you. That is, 
if this slot doesn't kill you first. I haven't tried it yet. Mm. Doesn't look promising. Not unlike your situation. I could try to extract you from here, you know. Because you do wish to disembark, do you not? Yeah, sure. But what on earth could you? Oh, more than you'd ever expect. I shall help you, Geralt. But before I do, I must know you return the favor. Right. Can't possibly get something for nothing. Indeed. When all's said and done, I am a merchant. So, do you want my help? Yes. It's a deal. Once it's all over, we shall meet at midnight at the crossroads, meet the willows near the village of Yantra. Ah, and I must give you something to remember me by. What's that? A mark to show we're associates. Who are you gabbing with? With... no one. Oh, never like boat. Not one bit. I heave like devils. Make me stomach churn. Oh, it'd be a crime to sleep through the whole thing. Didn't bargain for no storm. I fear that means a tidy jump in my feet. To a fear get us safely. The king's reward will be generous. What about the prisoner? Before the king, we must bring him. On doing so, my honor relies. Can we just bring your king the bastard's head? Like we're doing with the other? The other drought. We could do nothing. We deliver mine, this one. Apart from all else, the hell the king is sure to condemn him to. I wish to see that. What kind of hell? Ari, flaying, and water. This is for regicide and hells. Don't know about the rest of you, but I'm fully erect right now. Oh shit. Page. Okay. Let's... Oh, I've got my potions. That's fortunate. Uh, shield. I don't know why, but I wasn't taking a shield seriously. I guess because it's smaller. Oh, chest. I'm assuming that has all my shit in it. Okay, this is gonna be a problem. Really? Dude? Cut your fucking dick off. That kind of. Oh, okay, yeah, this is gonna be a problem. Gonna want to take this asshole out. Shouldn't have done the full roll, but anyway. Get as close to the mage as we can. Ah, uh, he's telling the works, of course he has. Okay, maybe I won't be able to get near him until gotta keep an eye on the sand. Yeah, I probably won't be able to get near him until I've killed all these guys. That's my assumption anyway. Yeah, based on oh, not a whole lot really. But uh Ah, oh shit, wrong one. Alright, hit me. Okay, that wasn't good. <clears throat> Don't use that on the uh, spell then. Alright. Doesn't seem like his uh, spells hurt his own dudes. Fucking. There we go, just. Cunt off. Yeah, we're gonna need the health. Now, yep, that seem, seems my hypothesis was correct. Can't line it up. Oh, Jesus. You may as well lock on to him. Haven't been using a lock on at all. 
I mean, it is useful. I imagine we won't straight up kill this guy. We'll probably, like, have the option to spare him or talk to him. Maybe he'll become, like, a sort of companion. I doubt that, though. He seems pretty adamant on, uh, seeing me tired, quartered, and flayed. Though, probably not in that order, because what's the point of flaying someone after you've quartered them? Okay, this, this guy's... Oh, oh, Jesus. I am Rashid of the Turbulent Winds. Remember the name well. Speaking of which, I got to play a lot of the Street Fighter V beta. God, I'm so bad. Well, I mean, well, you know that because I uploaded some videos and I completely forgot about that. I'm so bad at it. It's not even funny. Like, it's really fucking depressing after a while. Nope, nope, he's just straight up dead. Alright, fuck him. I thought I was going to do that thing where you bring them to low health and then, you know, you get to talk to them. Kind of loot him. Ah, here's a little bag. Letter from Ophiri Merchant. No idea, have I? Oh god, I've got to read it in backwards Yoda speak, haven't I? Oh dear. No idea have I why the most gracious crown mage, Ahmad, designated all people you as our liaison. The argument that you know that you best know this land, being Nordling yourself, do not I find in the least bit convincing, because Edern's as much to do with Redania as Zagania has with Ophir, namely nothing. Dude, you can't be both eloquent and talk in backwards speak. You know, it's, it's not fair. Just pick one and stick to it. But as the wishes of his graciousness are not to be disputed, beseech you I to try to deliver him this message. Our camp we have stayed near Brunwich, a village. In keeping with the orders given us by the court and his graciousness, knowledge and goods of our land we now share with the local populaces. Sadly, as to, our men, as to their mental capacities, my predictions rightly judged, so I renew my request for permission to travel towards a greater urban settlement where our knowledge and experience would be greater appreciated. Better appreciated, I should say. You know, accuracy, it's important. We'll loot all of these guys. Obviously get all of our shit back first. Oh, no. I guess we're not getting all our shit back. That's... Why are they all carrying those? Oh, this guy's got nothing. Well, perhaps... Um... But well, what's his name? The mirror guy will have all of my stuff. Well, <laughs> in the lack of... Oh, wait, no. Oh, no, I have all my stuff. All right, never mind then. I was worried about nothing. Oh, no, I don't. No. Wait. I have some of my stuff. Whatever wasn't equipped on me at the time. Ah, uh, okay, I see, I see. I'll have my wolf and steel sword. I don't have my wolf and silver sword, but I've got this. So that'll have to do. I guess we'll put this on. Yeah, that's better. That's a shame. I was kind of uh, hoping I could use this, because, you know, it looks cool as shit. And it's blue. Okay, any other gear? Yeah, gloves. Any gloves? Um, mask? Oh, good, I still got these. Okay, that seems... Seems fine. So, we've been playing for quite a bit. I feel like I've been playing for longer than that first run before I had the break, even though I said I wouldn't. But, you know, we uh, got caught up in the story. So I'm going to end it here, because it's been going on for a while, and getting a bit hungry, to be honest. So, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And when we get back, for the next run, we'll be meeting Master Mirror, hopefully getting all our shit back, and, of course, meeting the other Khajiit merchant, so I can get the diagrams or weapons or armor or whatever wank it is that he's supposed to have for me. So, until then, see you then.